Hey, good morning everybody, happy Tuesday. Today you're going to be working in your packet for this science worksheet about light experiment. So you'll cut and sort those items into the right place. And you can show me how that worked out, sending me a picture on your portfolio. Next, let's look into math. Yesterday we started with telling time on the hour. Here's a fun little song for us to enjoy. Tick-tock, tick-tock, hear the chiming of the clock. Tick-tock, tick-tock, every hour we hear it talk. When it strikes one, we we'll start the fun. When it strikes two, play a kazoo. When it strikes three, dance with me. When it strikes four, tap the floor. When it strikes five, buzz into the hive. When it strikes six, stir and make. Seven, yell my name's Kevin When it strikes eight, stand and wait When it strikes nine, hold up a sign When it strikes ten, let's dance again When it strikes eleven, let's start waving When it strikes twelve, clap for yourselves Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve Tick, tock, tick Hear the chiming of the clock Tick, tock, tick, tock Every hour we hear it talk Okay, so everybody ready? Yesterday when we looked at the clocks, they looked like this yellow one. We said the blue one is bigger, so it's the minute hand, and we said the red one is smaller, it's the hour hand. And this clock is called an analog clock. This is the kind of clock you probably see lots of these at home. You might have an alarm clock by the bed, one on the microwave, one on the stove. This is called a digital clock. So this one has the hour hand pointing to three and the minute hand straight up to 12, which we learned yesterday is the beginning of a new hour. And when we write that, since we were at the beginning of the hour, zero minutes have started in the three o'clock hour yet. So we'll write it's three o'clock with zero minutes. And that's what that's, it's going to look like when we look at the exercises in our book, okay? So here on the first page, it says, write what the digital clock would show when it's seven o'clock. And really, all we have to do then is just write a seven in that spot because seven o'clock would be our hand on seven and no minutes have gone yet. So we're going to practice writing these times into the digital clock showing hours and minutes. Okay? And then after that, you'll have a fun video activity part two of the cooperation video. I hope you liked those characters from Jelly Bean Jungle yesterday. All right, and we will look at the lesson that's on the front of your packet, and it says you're just gonna watch the video today. And yesterday you did the Feeling Faces worksheet that's in your packet. Today, there, there just isn't one, I don't think. So you'll just watch the video. You will upload pictures of your light experiment worksheet and uh, practice writing the times from an analog clock to the digital clock, okay? I'm gonna be back with a new cool thing for you to do with your Super Kids lessons in just a few minutes on the next video. Have a great time. See you soon.